Good morning everyone! Welcome back to my channel! So this video will be a room tour plus 360 accommodation tour. I wouldn't say this is the most requested video but I would say someone requested this video a while ago. Shout out to you for requesting this video. And also if you guys are not aware, I actually have less than a week before I leave Swansea for good. I've been so emotional and I'm actually just not ready to leave Swansea. But I have to guys. I have to. My cat is waiting. Gizmo is waiting for me at home. So I have to go back. Okay, and so let's start this room tour. This is my room. I'm in room A. Let's go in. This is the key over here. We just tap here. Welcome to my room. It's a room reveal for 2022. Okay, let's start. Let's do this pretty quick. So we have the switch. It's for the lights. So we have two lights. And then we have the heater. This is where you can control the heater. So this, you can turn on the heater. And then we have a place for me to hang my coats and jackets. And then these are my shoes. When I first came here, I only have this two. But I guess I expanded. It's been six months. And then we have a heater. This is what a heater looks like. So we have the switch over here. You can turn it on and turn it off. This is all we have. We only have a heater. We don't have a fan or an aircon. If you guys are wondering, we only have a heater. So if it, it's hot, then you just close the heater. And if it's cold, you can open the heater. And then, okay, let's continue to the next part. This is my bed. Um, so this bed is actually big. Two people can sleep on this bed. It's actually big. Um, I'm sorry if my bed looks a bit messy or not, you know, tegang. But I just don't know how, guys. Dia macam tak nak tegang, but it's okay lah kan. Um, so... This is a place for storage. You can put your makeup or anything. So we have Dettol, Febreze. Yeah, we have my makeup and stuff. So this is my small little decoration. We have my fairy lights and a dream catcher from home. And then let's move on to this part. We have a built-in cupboard. A shelf, a shelf, I'm sorry. So the first row, I put my food. And the second row, I put my books. And the third row is just a mixture of everything. Yeah, so there's a lot of storage in this room. This is my desk. Look at my desk. It's so huge. I'm not even kidding. When I first came here, I'm like, what? It's so long. And we have this super huge board, which I don't know. It's so huge. It's so huge for a person, for one person. So let's just go here. There's three drawers let's go to drawer number one there's just my personal stuff and then drawer number two is basically my mask and my medicines and stuff and then drawer number three is my rice cooker and my plates my glass and yeah let's close this and move on to the board so this is basically word of wisdom and then we have a list you know i like to do a list and then this is my receipt my watch, my small whiteboard, my calendar. I love calendars. My ukulele over here. And then look at this. I bought this here. There's paper clips, thumbtacks, this thing. What is this called? And a rubber band. This is my laundry bag over here. So, and then this chair is also super comfortable. We have a spinning chair. And as you can see, there's an arrow over here. It's actually my keyblad. Let's go to this section. This is a huge cupboard for my clothes. It's really huge. I'm not even joking. So let's open this. So we have the first part where you can hang your clothes. And then I have my huge luggage over here. And then there's more storage up there. So we're going to open the next door. So look at that. It might be not so neat, 
because I'm leaving soon guys I really didn't have the time to really organize things but these are my shawls and then my clothes I know it's little but I really have just little clothes here but some of them are in that laundry bag and then there's more storage down there and these are my food look at that I only have less than 10 days but if you guys are wondering my mom brought all of these last week I don't even know how am I gonna finish all these in a week and then on top here we have more storage these are my sweaters I put them I put them on top um so this is my view are you guys ready so this is what my view every morning looks like I think there's gonna be a lot of people downstairs surprise yeah there's a lot of people so this is my view this is what we call as student rules st david's so i'm gonna close this now because people are watching okay so let me show you what does it look like at night let me close the lights and open the fairy lights look at that it looks really romantic this is how I sleep every night. Okay, that's that's enough. Okay, and the last... Oh, I forgot. There's a really huge mirror over here. So, let's move on. Now, this is my bathroom. Ta-da! We have railings, um, toilet, sink. And then this is the shower. Yeah. It's enough. Oh, in case you guys are wondering, if you guys are gonna live in the UK, there's not gonna be any pipe at the toilet. There's not gonna be any pipe. Well, there's no pipe in the public toilet as well as your own home. Unless you apply it, like you insert your own pipe. There's not gonna be any pipe. Yeah. So yeah, that's it. I'm sorry for the dirty mirror. Hey guys, I'm in front of my student accommodation right now and I'm gonna give you guys a 360 tour. If you guys are wondering, today is actually my last day here. I'm leaving at 12. Right now it's 10. And I'm gonna do this 360 accommodation tour because I'm gonna regret it if I don't do it. So let's go guys. So I am in front of Student Roost St. David. This is the building. Uh, we're gonna enter the reception and I'm not gonna say anything. So the first thing that you guys are gonna see is the reception, okay? Let's go. cinema room but there's someone inside so we're not gonna enter this there's someone inside this is the way to block A this is the first block and then we have the laundry room let's enter the laundry room this is the laundry room so I have to pay in order to wash my clothes and then we have a vending machine. Yeah. So this is it. This is the... We're currently in the middle of the building. There's a lot of blocks. Those are the blocks. My block is that one, which is block B. These are some bicycles. We're gonna enter the student hub. student hub the one i celebrated raya we have a lot of spaces to sit there's a big tv it's so dirty it's so messy i bet someone used this last night there's a ping pong table there's a pool table and then we have a karaoke room this is what it looks like some place to sit and a karaoke 
place. The next thing I want to show you guys is the gym. This is the gym. I've been here a few times and that's just it. This is the gym. It's a pretty small gym, but it's it's good enough. Goodbye, gym. And the rest are the blocks, and we're gonna go to that block. Block, that block. Hold on. We're now at block F. Let's go in. This is the newest block. We have vending machines. And then we have the study room. This is the study room. So this is the study room. A place where I usually study. Okay. There's a lot of places for you to sit and chill. There's books, there's couches, there's a table. And this is the real place to sit and study. See, there's a lot of tables and chairs. Yes, this is the student rooms, everyone. I think that's all. It's a pretty nice student accommodation, I have to say. This is the way to my block. I'm gonna go and take the left. kitchen the kitchen doesn't look that great right now but I'm just gonna give a five second view this is the kitchen there's a lot of stuff but like you know this is a shared kitchen so this is the kitchen it's pretty huge that's all yeah so basically that's all for the 360 accommodation tour and also my room tour i hope you guys enjoyed this video this video might be up a bit late i might be back in malaysia by then but see you guys next time thank you so much for your support that's the end of my journey in wales bye guys stay safe